Hello, welcome to Film Hype, I'm Steven Baker. Today is the 26th day of October, and the year is 2010. And I'd like to first off start by telling you all, I've not been cussing on my show, and I've got a lot of people asking me why I haven't been, and it's kind of because I don't want to, for the kids, but there's not any kids that watch it, so I say, fuck that, and I'm gonna start cussing, so... If you don't like it, sorry, but I'll change it, but... If you have a problem with it, let me know, but that's the question of the day, so I ruined that for you. Here's the news. If you're a big fan of Jackass 3D, they're going to release Jackass 3.5 after Christmas on DVD, so check that out. It will be, you know, more Jackass dudes, you know, shooting stuff out of their butts and me sitting here going, what the hell. One of my most hated films of all time, Top Gun, is actually probably going to get a sequel or a remake or one of those things, but basically, it's Top Gun. I hate that movie. Don't ask me why, I just dislike Top Gun. I apologize. Rotten Tomatoes put together a list of things you could be for Halloween from the movies. It gives you a basically a inside list of, you know, what you need to be certain characters for movies, and it's actually kind of cool, so check that out if you uh, get the chance. The link's at the bottom, you know, it shows you how to be people from Indiana Jones to Marty McFly, and, you know, instead of being a little whore girl like a lot of women are, you should definitely try to check out and be something classy, and not like a skinky you know, flapper. Maybe be like a horde Jedi, because that'd be pretty cool, right? Chris Nolan just announced that he's looking for someone to play the lead role in Batman 3 in her late 20s, early 30s, so I'm pretty positive that it might be Catwoman, because I'm not a fucking idiot. But if it is Catwoman, then I called it. I called it. In some good and or bad news, they're re-releasing Indiana Jones movies after they do the first Star Wars film. This should be released next week by Lucasfilm if they're actually going to do it or not. But rumor on the street, actually on the web, but the rumor on the web is that they're doing Indiana Jones 3D and they'll release all four films in 3D, which is cool, I guess. Zach Galifianakis got casted in the new Muppets movie alongside Jason Segel, so good luck with that, Mr. Galifianakis and your Muppets. Because that movie is Muppet-tastic. Part of Tron Tuesday, the thing that Disney's doing that I've been updating you guys about, a music video got released of the Daft Punk music, and it also shows Daft Punk in the movie, so check out their cameo there, robots still, beep beep boo, beep beep boo, beep beep boo, Tron music, dong. I saw Paranormal Activity 2 over the weekend, this is my review, I thought it was good, I thought it was not as good as the first one, but it was scarier because they had a higher budget, and if you mix a kid and a dog into the situation, you're gonna get scarier stuff. Uh, some of the things I can recommend, because I can't really tell you anything about the movie without ruining it, is go with a girl who's not going to ask you a whole bunch of questions because that gets fucking annoying, and even if you are guaranteed some puss law, do not go for it at all because you will be annoyed and you won't be able to enjoy the picture. Um, there's a couple more on my list, but that's in my review, so check out my review. The link's at the bottom for that. In some stupid, stupid news, I guess there is a movie coming out about Justin Bieber saying never give up or something, but Justin Bieber has his own movie about himself and it basically is co-starring Usher and Jaden Smith. And this is a documentary and it's in 3D of course so they can rake in all the money from those little girls that are in love with Justin Bieber, but check it out, it's basically Justin Bieber from when he's a little kid to now and a whole bunch of girls saying how much they love him. Oh, I can just see that all the time on Facebook. The question of the day last week was answered as John Hamm, most of you said, so that's pretty fucking badass. Thank you very much for agreeing with me. And let's get to the question of the day for now. Do you think me cussing on this fucking show is cool, or do you think it's shitty? So let me know what you think about that, and I'll answer that on Friday, and you will obviously notice if there's something different about Friday's show. I just wanted to pitch a couple things out there before I end the show. Uh, I'm in desperate need for a graphic designer who knows how to use Photoshop, who can make me just a logo for Film Hype. That'd be really cool. And I also need a musician to make me like a beat, like kind of a hip-hop beat, like I kind of led this show off with. But I need it for future shows because I need an original beat that would be my own and I'd own it instead of using a beat that I got already off the internet. So thank you very much. If you have any details about anyone I can do it with or even you, message me, I'll get it as an email or Facebook me or Twitter me and that will be really cool so thank you very much and thank you for watching Film Hype, I'm Stephen Baker and I will check you on the flip side, bye.